Hi, this is Brian from Riverside Reptiles Education Center. Welcome to our YouTube channel. And uh, of course, don't forget to like and subscribe at the end of this video. So today we are going to feed Eve, our King Cobra. She's over my shoulder, but I'm not sure if you can see her. I'm sure she's, yep, she's watching us right now. Um, so we're going to feed her today. And King Cobras, their favorite prey in the wild is other snakes. In fact, their genus, Ophiophagus, means eater of snakes. Uh, but here at Riverside Reptiles, we don't sacrifice healthy snakes to feed other snakes. So we have a little trick we do uh, to entice Eve into eating her food. So follow me. I'm going to go get her food ready and we're going to go see if she's hungry. All right, so we have everything we need for our meal prep for Eve. I always have a Ziploc bag full of uh, shed skin from our Vietnamese Blue Beauty. So uh, Eve's favorite food uh, or favorite snake to eat are rat snakes. She loves rat snakes. She'll eat some other snakes. She's, she's eaten some other snakes that passed away here at Riverside Reptiles, but rat snakes are her favorite. So we use the shed skin from the uh, Vietnamese Blue Beauty, which is an Asian species of rat snake. So I have a shed skin right here and I have a huge pile of some delicious mice. Um, they were all thawed out last night. So what I'm gonna do, the first thing I'm gonna do, <laughs> it's kind of gross, but you cut off the tail. So when we're putting this, this, the mice in the shed skin, the tails just tend to get away. So we're gonna cut the tails off first. And again, these are dead mice. They're not feeling a thing. And these are my educator's scissors. We'll clean them off and I'll give them back to her. Don't tell her, please. All right, so the mice are ready to go. So we'll get a good length of the skin All right, so all we do is pretty much just take the mice and put them inside the skin. Now you have to be kind of gentle because snake skin or shed skin is rather fragile. And I like using the tail end right here because you don't have to really tie a knot. They kind of just funnel into it. All right, and we just keep going. Usually she eats anywhere from six to 10 mice, depending on the size of the mice. I think we have eight thawed out right here. And I don't like to make it too heavy because typically she grabs the, she grabs this, she brings it all over the enclosure. Uh, most of the time she tears it in half, but she'll still come back and eat the mice um, since the mice have been scented already with the, uh, with the shed skin.
All right. So my next step is to tie a knot in the top of it. And this is the part where I have to be very careful not to tear the skin. It doesn't need to be a super tight knot. Tight enough. There we go. Voila, it's my uh, burrito. It's my snakeskin stuffed of mouse burrito, Riverside Reptiles Education Center specialty for King Cobra. So let's go bring this to her and um, hopefully she eats it. <music>
Thank you so much for watching this video. Eve is actually, she's still uh, behind me. She's looking for the rest of her food. I didn't want to stress her out too much. So uh, we videotaped her eating a little bit and then we left her by herself so she can enjoy the rest of her meal without a camera shoved in her face. But thank you so much for watching this video. Again, don't forget to like and subscribe, comment below, um, and please share this video so we can get the word out there. And uh, Brian from Riverside Reptiles, thanks again so much. We'll see you later.